speaking about um, HP in uh, RPGs, out of the frying pan and one the of the freezer. reasons I like uh, a game series called This Guy is because you, can, you start out with like Pokemon level <coughs> HP and you can just keep going for pretty much as long as you want to keep grinding. Your HP will just keep going up. Wow, that's awesome. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. I think you don't gotta tell me. Just fucking go. Uh, what do you mean? Get to the exit. Stop. Stop goofing around. Stop screwing around back there. <laughs> I'll turn around and hit you both. My dad used to say that a lot. <laughs> Did he hit you? No, never. He, my dad never touched me. He only he only kissed me on my shoulders. Did you say, Daddy, don't touch me there? <laughs> I, I did. I sang it. Daddy, don't touch me there. This, uh... Can't wait for the I need food line. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm waiting for it, too. He's already... He's still bitching. I, I like this area as well, though. Again, I, I, I was impressed with that water effect. You see how it slows down at the bottom? They're really not doing anything fancy with it. It's still just, I think, JPEGs, but translucent. It's pretty, uh, it looks pretty good, though. The remains of a campfire with flint and tinder, you can start another fire here. Uh, we didn't start the fire. No. I did. Okay. So, <laughs> what do you say? It's been 30 minutes. We can keep going for another couple of minutes. Okay. Let's go for like 40. Gay boy is in the ruins and his adventure continues. Gay boy's in the house. <laughs> Gay boy in the house, I love that show. Yeah. It's my favorite. So, nope. do you feel like we should cut out, uh, maybe not this since it's a pretty simple puzzle, although I expect you to take about 30 minutes, but... Uh, some of the I just like to to explore. There's definitely some some later stuff that requires grinding. Yeah, yeah, definitely cut out grinding. Yeah. Or if things take a couple more right. tries, like several attempts, I think we should make make a point to cut it out, or at least put a highlight reel of just, Whoop. you know. Again, I like yeah. I like these changing angles with the sort of static backgrounds, but the the camera follows you through it. It's a bit jarring sometimes, but usually it's fine. It's like you you get the director's angle of their the world they made. Not nearly as jarring as it was in like Final Fantasy VII. I never played seven. Uh, I I one time tried to go back to it, but I it was pretty mm -hmm. slow to to start, and I I have less patience for RPGs now. You uh, having some trouble there? <laughs> yeah, it's like pitch black. Turn the brightness up. You turn your brightness. Up. I always have my brightness on max. My life brightness. I try just just try to stay positive. I feel like I didn't get everything, but I also feel like I don't know what else there is you, to get. You just sort of feel empty inside. Okay, where's the flint? Why don't you call out for it? Isn't there a flint button? Oh, well, you can go around looking at descriptions for things. Also like Resident Evil, and uh, of course a bunch of other video games. What's a video game? <clears throat> it's like a type of bird. Oh wow! Yeah, they all there we suck. Go. There we go. There's just some some flint left in this cabinet that yeah. someone was just using. Hmm. I need some flint. Oh, here it is. <laughs> in this drawer. All right, now let's go make a campfire. And he's still in his. He's still got his hoodie and. He just completely <laughs> looks Kingdom Hearts. I was really disappointed with him looking Kingdom Hearts. And that sign on his right hip, the, the Jekt sign, also looks like Kingdom Hearts stuff. 
He's got a zip off mesh pant leg. Yeah. <laughs> it all, every every piece of his clothing is zip off. <laughs> every centimeter got a, can yeah, zip off. Exactly. Completely customized. <laughs> oh things. my god. This this is his like you know, masterpiece customization. It it came in like two thousand individual food. parts and this is his perfect assemblage. There it is. I need food. <laughs> He's like, I'll, I'll just die then, because I can't provide for myself. I talked over it. Who did? You did or I did? I did. Fucking idiot. I ruined the whole Let's Play. Let's start over. Cut it out. Delete it. Shut it all down. Shut it down. I'm in. Th I'm in. This is almost like... I can't fucking remember this director's name. Uh, David Lynch. It's always... This is like almost David Lynch, how they try and throw in these like weird sort of like psychological flashbacks where he's like fixated on really weird things. Like <clears throat> like him crying all the time. Uh, again, I, I really think they wanted to emphasize that he was like such a bitch that he like... He, <laughs> especially when like... He's really insecure about how he used to cry a lot when dealing with his father. Gay boy fucking passed out. I think if it wasn't, like, very anime, it would be um, easier to, you know, understand. Or not understand, empathize, you know what I yeah, mean? Yeah, but I, I don't feel like this game can escape being anime. So much of it is rooted in just being a Japanese R like RPG. Yeah. It's not You can't separate the anime from this and have it survive. It's just part of it. You have to just accept it for what it is. Gay, I do like the, the changing camera angles in this fight. Because it's like nothing else changes. Yeah. That's what they it's do. literally just back and forth attack, oh, nice, the attack. Nice dodge, gay boy. Thanks. And then things don't look and so then here hot. Comes, here come the gypsies. <laughs> and here comes the freaks. The the Holocaust survivors. <laughs> the oppressed ones. Oppression squad. <laughs> they actually sort of look like Nazis. They do have Nazi themes because mainly because that one guy is just wearing a like gas mask, but the rest of them just look like they, circus clowns. They give circus you circus clowns like the rest of them. They give you her first person view for a second, and then she's got some like attitude. But our <laughs> our easygoing protagonist is just like another good guy. Awesome. Our, <laughs> I, I'm young. You're on our team? Okay. Cool. Excellent. Super duper. Should I use the last grenade or save it? Fuck it up. Use it. Wait, let me steal. Go ahead. You okay. Grab a potion. Oh, grenade. There you go. It, it's probably gonna Ooh. tell me what... It's probably gonna tell me to steal in a second here. So who is Unless... this... Who is this mysterious person that we've just been acquainted with? Three coup. Four question marks? Yeah. One more grenade. I don't think you can steal anything at this point. I don't know. Don't. She's supposed to be like... She's... I think supposed to be underage, but the game is like really... Zooming in on her privates. No, that happens all, all the, the time. time. I don't know. How, how do you know she's supposed to be underage? Like, was is there something in the that you remember in the game? That yeah, like right here. Look at that. Yeah. And it's, um, it's flesh-colored as well. Yeah, it's flesh-toned. Like, oh, uh, oh mama. The little girl. Like the little girl in Final Fantasy IX. But, um... Yeah, I loved seeing her naked. That was close. I, I have the guidebook. The gay book? Hey, yeah, the gay book. And I think it says her age in there. I remember her being uh, underage. <clears throat> Leave gay boy alone. And stop! Stop yelling like, Spanish at him. 
their idea of another language is just English, but with the letters it, switched around. Exactly, but it they switch the vowels with vowels, and they do sort of make some weird language. It, 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 if I could say they're closest to anything, I would say like Russian. Although you well, you will have a different perspective now that you. I would know. Oh, oh, we have a very naughty scene here. I could tell that she said sorry just because the way, you know, the letters were arranged. I'm pretty sure she said, I love you. She said, I'm gay, lol? <laughs> With a question mark at the end. She said, I am a retard. <laughs> I really wish I could find that video so I could use it. You should just scour the internet. This, these, uh, these ships are cool, actually. These giant metallic, cool. like, behemoth ships. They use scale a lot in this game to pretty pretty good effects. I agree with you. So Titus is in the... He's in a different world. However, the story hasn't really revealed that yet. But this is like... He's already changed worlds. But the, the sort of, like, the setting is very similar. It's still futuristic here. Which I actually think is, is interesting the way they handled that. Yeah, it's not immediately evident that he's in a different world, which is you know it, it adds more to the his like sort of uh, I don't know how you would say this like whatever he's going Dick. through right now. There's a there's a term for it. I said I don't understand. Spaghetti, spaghetti dream. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Fever dream. I sort of that's what I was going for. Who Klamala? Chlamydia. You understand me? <laughs> and they just fucking punch him. You understand me? And they just punch him. <laughs> Shut up. And then you uh, just, and then just, you just start gallantly prancing around. Yeah, the running is very... It's very exaggerated. Uh, flamboyant. What do we got here? Fear grid... Tutorial. This we is, can skip. I'm gonna skip this. Oh, of course. But as fast as I can. And, and you might even, you might even do to edit if if it's this takes too long or just cut ahead like after we finish talking about the sphere grid. But do you like the sphere grid? Yeah, yeah, I think it's pretty good. I I, I actually like it as a level up system. I, at first, I was really annoyed with. I don't like it when games force you to learn a system. But uh, once it once it does eventually force you to learn it, it is pretty rewarding just because each character uh, shares all the spheres, and later on it, it gets to be a lot more meaningful. Like you actually can't spend certain spheres, and you have to prioritize it for different characters. But they're all still leveling up at the same pace. Yeah, I like that you can overlap with other characters' uh, abilities and things, and teleport to other places in the sphere grid. Sort of hijack yeah. other paths. And, um... Part of what I liked so much when I was uh, playing this last time was in the Sphere Grid. And, um... How oh, you can get potions from that guy for some reason. Was he the guy that punched you? <laughs> He's like, here's a couple on me, and he punches you again. Wait, what's this, this cutscene about? Uh, this is the story progressing, I believe. Oh no, I have or... to save. Well, what were we on? Oh wait, the sphere grid part. I guess we'll talk about the rest later. Yeah. Well, alright. I guess... No. I guess that's it for this... This... Sesh. That's it for this Let's Play. The rest, That's it. <laughs> you're gonna have to pay twenty dollars on Patreon, and we'll yeah. we'll release the the rest for our. This is only a sample for our subscriblets. Look at All look right, at well. uh, your your Riku and I'm Titus, and that's our little portrait together down there. We're about to kiss, and okay. we we've kissed. All right, let's stop recording. Let's stop. Ki let's start kissing. <laughs>